uh, one of the things I asked Kevin to do is to model for us taking up space and, and you know, taking the time to say who you are, uh, to tell some of the things that you've accomplished. So I appreciate you doing that, Kevin. And even when you asked me to, to take up space in the introduction, right, I, I felt a little anxiety. I was just like, oh, my goodness, I have to you know, talk about myself. But then I started to reflect and think, like, you know, why am I feeling anxious about this? Why I am actually doing all these things? Like, I can see if I was a fraud, you know, but, but I'm actually doing all these things. So why is it uncomfortable to talk about it? Uh, why does it feel like braggadocio? You know, why does it feel like these things? And so, um, you know. And I feel like as far as like what you said, as far as like men and women difference, honestly, I don't really feel like there is too much of a difference as far as how we feel. Mm -hmm. I think the main difference is how we act or respond to that feel. Mm, I um, love this. Okay. I, mm -hmm. I think because uh, I thought about my own self and when you kind of talked about it, I was like, well, we feel like that too. But I was like, well, I'm just really good at like pushing past it or like putting up that front or putting up that like, it doesn't matter what my emotion is at that time, I have to behave this certain way. Mm -hmm. uh, but I might've been just as startled or anxious or whatever that emotion was at that time, fearful. Uh, but I've kind of, and I don't know if that's like a society, like a pressure society puts on us. Like, man, we have to respond this way. We can't show emotion, those type of things. Um, but, you know, I would say I, I, I behave the same way I feel like society expects me to behave. If I don't show that emotion. I do push past whatever feeling that I'm feeling in that moment. And um, yeah, I feel like we get it too in different ways. 